Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Alpha Central, I'm your host Jack, and today we're taking a look at when women get rejected. Now let's jump right in, right after you subscribe, of course. Disclaimer, this video was made for strictly comedic slash artistic purposes. Aww, kick. Helvete. It's no offense is intended towards any individual featured in this video. What do you do for a living? Well, I'm retired, I play a lot of golf, and okay. I just recently celebrated my 49th wedding anniversary. Wow. <laughs> That's pretty good, man. That's not easy. Yeah. You gotta treat her respect, take her on great trips. For our 25th, I took her to China, and next year I'm gonna go pick her up. Man, that's the only true secret to a long and healthy relationship. Can I get your number? Yeah. You can get my number, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, wait. No, what? It's like a checklist of things I want in women, so. I weigh 170. Two, oh. whoa! Have a good day, it was nice meeting you. And that, my friends, is an Uno reverse being played in real life. Low interest rates are slamming. Low interest rates, I'm sorry. You got a nice. Why? Because you, you can save some money. <laughs> I'll take it. This guy stood his ground against an influencer who was running out of content. <laughs> he probably saw into the future where she's fighting for half the things he owns. Would you date a girl with a fan site? I'll play it off, but she gotta pay me too, though. She has to pay you? Yeah, along with the fan site. What about you? Would you date a girl with a fan site? Hell no. No. No, no, no. That's part of your morals, no way. <laughs> Men, if you're gonna have one preference, just one, let it be no fan sites. You know what I just thought of? <laughs> what? No female has ever been to the moon. Why do you think that is? Oh, it doesn't need to be clean, does it? Boys, that sounds like a skill <laughs> issue to me. My friend thinks you're really cute, and she's just shy. Is it okay if she comes over here? <laughs> Come here, this is my sister! Yeah, it's okay. This is my sister! <laughs> Why? It's okay. She's cute! You are. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? This is my twin! What are you talking about? That's yeah, cool. Right? That's my sister. Yeah. I'm married. I'm already married. Who the fuck You're cares married? if it's her sister? No. Uh, it's okay. Have a good one. <laughs> Was this an experiment to show that men have taste? Guy probably called up his contractor saying, you're never gonna believe this. Yo, look at that chest! Holy cow, is that even what? real? Like, actually, what the Like, you literally can't be talking like that. That's what? Like, what? are you being my friend just like, has, that's actually My friend just has a chest. Yo, I got this chest for you. No, you guys for me? Which one of you got it for me? I got it for you. Why the why do you even, why do you have that? Like, actually, why do you have that? Like, are, like, are you playing like, with what? Like, what? little Lego? No. There probably was a point where she realized she messed up, but a woman admitting oh, she was wrong is rarer than one apologizing. <laughs> My man saw the next 50 years of his life flash before his eyes and decided it was better to take a dip in the ocean. So, I, I don't know what this is, this is sort of like, very anti-feminist, I guess. <laughs> or not really, I mean, I don't know, it's not woke though. So uh, I guess we'll have to see how much, how much poo poo I'm in for doing this video. I have a terrible cold, all right, but I'm also an optimist. So I look at this in a positive light, where at the very, very least, I won't have to taste her cooking at all. Andrew, my cooking is good. I'm cooking. That is so. When she heard herself say it the third time, even she stopped believing in it. Kiss or slap? Slap. She wanted a daddy, he became her father figure. Look at the 10 pounds of makeup you're wearing. <laughs> oh, those are too cute for me. Yeah, you're right. You have Yeah, just because you got 10 bodies doesn't make you a 10. Normalized clapping back at women who've only ever encountered simps. Yeah. Right. Where do I put it? On the ground? Who needs a man? That's all Not me, baby. Not me. Let's see. Oh my god. What the? 
That's not oil. <laughs> no shit. Now oil is coming, you see? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Yes, sir, I'm recording it. Uh, and I do have a whistle. Like, why would you do that? Why would you do that? What's the point of that? Somebody put windshield washer or something? Something like that. So the car was getting. No, I don't know. She just brought it. Oh, Jose. Yo. You said her washer fluid is not working. She told me that too. Okay. Strong, independent women minus the strength and in independence. Look, I've never had a worse breakup. They all th the same thing. Really, Patrice. <laughs> women try to force themselves on me, and I get very frightened. <laughs> Forcing me to call, forcing me to listen when they call, forcing me to watch the duck they want to watch on television, forcing me to take them out, forcing me to wear what they think I look cute in, forcing me to play Xbox with them when they're not even interested in the game. They get pissed away. Forcing me to, forcing me to cuddle afterwards, even in the summer. It's hot. <laughs> I still love you. Look at. <laughs> man ladies if you want to know how to make your man happy just think about what makes you happy and do exactly the opposite <laughs> feminists weren't ready for you patrick o'neill my man over here would have gotten canceled left and right so he beat them to yeah. it i am newly single and i have been single for three months and i chose to leave the man i was going to get married he was perfect on paper but i walked away why? Stupid. Because I am very... <laughs> and this is why, like, yo, this is what I'm trying to say. Arranged marriages are a thing because women make bad decisions. No, you, you, because you, I'm actually, like you. I'm that. very picky and I know what I want. And it's like, although someone's maybe perfect for me on paper and yeah, he treats me like a princess and things like that, there's things that I need. And if that person doesn't have it... You're 29. <laughs> yes, yeah, so Can you be a bit specific? Yeah, it's like, yeah. person was a people pleaser. What? Like, no. we, not just with me, but with like the family, his his friends. It, it was like the people around him. He was just. So he's a nice guy. He's a really <laughs> nice guy. To those of you who don't know what she wants, don't worry. She doesn't know either. How old do you have to be then as a woman to be considered a leftover? I think around 30, like after 30 years old. But if you're after 35 years old, then just you're out of the market. You know, it's it's more like you don't have to consider about getting married anymore. Just to maybe have a child on your own is the best way for you. In America, they'd call that a woman who knows what she wants. In China, they call it what it really is. Roll the window down. No, I'm not. I'm not rolling the window down. Roll the window so down. please leave. No, I'm not. <gasps> Look on the bright side, King. At least now you get to sue her for twice as much. Babe, I already know what for Father's Day. What? Why did she do that? I know I know it's gonna be hard, but I, get death. I want you to shut up the whole day. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to get that's the problem right now. You think I'm playing? I'm not gonna give you. When it comes from her, it's funny. When it comes from him, it's a call to 911. 